My name is Rick Hunt and I've worked at the Oak Towers Aged Care Service for about two and a half years. My role here is the chaplain. Um, what we do is, is look after the spiritual needs, principally of residents, staff and families. It's pretty broad ranging. We also, we get to know them. Everyone has a story and we celebrate the stories that people come with. It's important for them to know that there's someone on site who is able to listen, uh, is able to journey, can't fix things. But the person knows that, that we, representing Jesus and representing God, are able to share that love and that acceptance that God has for us with other people. Um, we have people of many different faiths and no faith. Uh, and it's a joy just to, to journey with people from such a variety of backgrounds. Simply through carrying on a, an air of care and an air of loving uh, and winning people over with love, uh, it's the way we build relationships from something which is initially a boundary, something which is initially a blockage, by continuing to smile, just to smile and say good day to someone. Uh, eventually God through that uses that attitude uh, and, and that interaction just to break down barriers that you may have with people. It, it's beautiful to see. The care that the staff provide residents here is absolutely extraordinary. It extends not just to the residents. Staff care also for families uh, and friends. Conversation with June recently, she just came in for respite. And the day she was leaving, I dropped in to, to say goodbye. And she said that she'd been overwhelmed. Overwhelmed is the word that she used by the care that she had received, by the way she had been looked after while she was here. Uh, we've got an extraordinary team here at Oak Towers. Absolutely extraordinary. We like to see it as a home, and it's not our home. We're staff who work here. It's the resident's home. Because it's the resident's home, their space is respected. Um, sure, we need to, to go in from time to time, but we have protocols in place to ensure that where it's possible, the resident's wishes and, and likes and dislikes are respected to the, to the fullest extent possible. This sense of home uh, is something which is really important that eases this sense of transition because the families get to know that their loved one is going into a place which is theirs. It's a place which, in which they are cared for, loved and respected.